Hello, this is Brandon with Be Clean Professionals here. We're here at another movie theater uh, cleaning in the Lancaster area. As you can see, I already got started here. Uh, we've done, there's six movie theaters. We've done uh, four of them so far. Look at the color difference here. This is clean, that's still dirty. This area is clean, that's still dirty. Then, so, you know, like I did say, we're getting started. We did this theater already. We have this hallway to do. We have this theater to do. You can see this gray in here. You ever wanna get that nice and clear? This in here, this high traffic area. We got this long hallway. We have this area in here. We're gonna be using some special cleaner on here to get this area really good. That's shadowing over there, that's shadowing. Um, here, I did let the customer know. She told me this is caked on butter from years and years. Now I did let her know that's not gonna come out. Um, I recommend, you know, this carpet here, at least the strip, get replaced. But we're still gonna clean it anyway, see what we can do with it. So stay tuned. So what I did in this video here, I just wanted to show this is the other part of the carpet. As you can see, I made a square, okay, of clean area that I went over. In the middle is the dirty area. Here is where we haven't gotten yet. So you could see just the color difference. That's a shadow. But you could see the color difference in the floor. Um, you know, we're really getting this dirt up. As you can see in the picture, there's still some white spots that's left over from the paint, from the cleaner we use. It's very strong, very high in pH level. Um, you know, the best thing to do is not get any paint on the carpet to avoid that from happening. The hot water extraction, we like to show the empty water. Here with low, with the low moisture cleaning, we like to show the pads. Um, that's what they look like before, brand new. You see, we use both sides of all of our pads. And we really got this dirt up. Hello, this is Brandon with Be Clean Professionals. We're done with the movie theater cleaning here today um, in Lancaster. You can see the floors turned out great. I'm gonna go run through here quick. You can check and you've seen before videos, before this, what it started to look like and during the process. I'm not gonna walk in all the theaters. I'm just gonna show you some of the common areas there that we really got up. Uh, here in front of the door is really dirty. I've seen a video of that right here. This area was all black. You've seen that in the video. Even the hallway, we did half the hallway and did the other cleaned half. Took pictures of that. It turned out great. All right. Now, a lot of the browning you see is because these haven't been cleaned in six months. So over that time frame, the dirt becomes permanently stained and the floors become lighter in color. I, see, I shared some color differences videos earlier. 
Now here's the main challenge, this room here, the main lobby. Um, this was really gunked up along the wall. We got that up really good. This is all butter, dried butter. You could see it on the floor. We can't do anything with that. Um, that till the customer has to be replaced. All right. Uh, there was paint. So you can see some light speckles. That's left over from the paint. Um, so that's gonna permanently be there. You know, the best way to avoid that is just don't get any paint on there, hire, you know, some good painters and uh, make sure they put the tarps down while they're painting. All right. So like I did say, some of the graying is, is, from, the, uh, is from not having them cleaned uh, every six months. Uh, because it's a movie theater, I would say every three months because it gets a lot of traffic. All right. Um, so once again, to avoid this from happening and staying this way, uh, you got to get them cleaned every three months. All right. Stay tuned for the next cleaning.